thank you for taking the time to actually take care of yourselves and being kind to yourselves. Um, that means a lot. Um, we will begin with just bringing our attention to the present moment. So if you uh, want to either close your eyes or you can just do it with your eyes open, just put your hand on your heart and just feel your heart beat for a moment. And when you're ready, just take three deep breaths. So in through the nose and out through the mouth. One more time. In through the nose. Out through the mouth. Try to get rid of all the negative energy you accumulated this week. In through the nose. And out through the mouth. Can you feel your heartbeat? Can you feel being here right now? Can you feel being alive? Excellent. For those who haven't done this session before, I'm just going to quickly say what we are doing today. So we will do six quick stretches and we will focus on the areas that are mostly affected when we are um, sitting down or working in front of the computer. And the first uh, stretch we will do uh, is concentrating on our neck. So make yourselves comfortable. Uh, remember to sit with your back straight. And when you're ready, just tilt your head to one side. Um, if you are tilting your head to the right, then uh, your left hand should go under your thigh. So it looks like you are sitting on it. And then with the opposite head, hand, just pull your head towards your shoulder. You should feel a really nice stretch along your neck and uh, the shoulder up here. If it's painful, ease it off. It shouldn't, you shouldn't feel pain. You should just feel uh, your muscles being stretched. There's a difference. Remember to breathe. And when you're ready, slowly switch sides. So we're starting with the head first, then put your hand under your thigh and pull towards your shoulder. If you want to feel the stretch a little bit more, I would recommend to close your eyes so then your senses are focused on the actual stretch. Let's just take a couple, couple more breaths. Okay, and when you're ready, you just go back to the center. Uh, the next uh, stretch is concentrating mainly at the back of your necks and on our heads. Um, it's particularly good if you are suffering from migraines or headaches. Um, I would probably recommend to move your chair slightly back so you don't hit your head on your table or on your um, desk and just put your hands together like that like a little basket and then um, put it at the back of your head and then with the weight of your hands just pull your head down but it shouldn't be a strong pull it just should your hands should be just resting at the back of your head and it should be just a natural pull what you will feel is uh, a great stretch at the back of your neck and you will feel your spine getting longer. You can feel all the good vi vibes going through your spine right now. At least I can. Okay, whenever you're ready, just slowly go back to the center. Hi, Laura. Um, the next uh, stretch we're going to do, um, it's going to uh, basically involve our shoulders and our chest. Um, this is particularly important whenever we are sitting in front of the computers and our shoulders go inwards um, and obviously our breath is affected. Mm -hmm. So we will open it up by simply taking our hands behind us. Um, 
and you're doing a hero pose basically. So if you just um, lift your head slightly and then feel that chest expanding. You should feel a really um, nice stretch at the back of your, uh, in, in between your shoulder blades basically. And if you can't feel it uh, enough, then you just need to uh, take your hands back as much as you can. Breathing in this position is not necessarily the easiest, but it will ensure that your chest is expanding a bit more. Okay, a couple more breaths, and then we move on to the next stretch. Perfect. So whenever you're ready, just uh, sit at the end of your chair. I'm going to show it from the side so you can see me. And um, with your right hand, just grab the end of your chair or the back of your chair and then look over your shoulder. This is particularly great for uh, the lower back stretch. If it's too painful, then look to the side rather than over your shoulder. Just try to ease it off. And remember to breathe. You don't have to be anywhere else. This is the place to be right now. Concentrate all your attention uh, on the lower back. Okay, whenever you're ready, switch sides. So with your left hand, just get hold of the back of your chair and uh, look over your left shoulder. Remember to breathe. Excellent. Now we're gonna move on to the bottom area. And um, I think the only one, or oh, maybe Colin and Nigel, you haven't heard that before, but basically when we are sitting down, um, we actually put a lot of pressure on our legs and on our bottoms. So it's very important that we, we look after those areas as well. Um, so if we just sit towards the center of our chair and uh, put one of our legs on top of the other, just like that. Um, now you have two options. You can either um, just grab your leg and tilt forward. I'm just going to show you from the side so you can do this. If, if you're new to this, then you can um, use your table as a, as a prop and just basically rest your elbows on your desk and then tilt towards your screen. Don't forget to smile and remember to breathe. This stretch might be a little bit painful, but it's really good for you. So it's definitely worth doing it. You're almost there. Three, two, one, and switch sides. So put the leg on top of the other. If, if you're not flexible enough to do that, you can also um, Put the leg slightly below your shoulder, below your knee. Um, but it, the most effective way to do this is actually putting the leg on top of the, the knee. Okay, grab your uh, grab your leg and then tilt forward. Remember to keep your back straight when you do this. Okay, two more breaths and we are almost there. We are almost done. Perfect. Okay, so last but not least, we're gonna look uh, at stretching our thighs. 
Uh, in order to do this, we'll have to stand up and use our chair as a prop. Um, and if you're wearing shorts or skates, short skirt, now is the time to turn off your video, probably. Um, basically, you, you put the leg on in the center of your chair, put the foot on the, in the center of your chair, and then when you're ready, just uh, lean forward as far as you can. The lower you go, the more stretch you should feel at the back of your thigh here. But uh, don't, don't feel like you have to be, go all the way down, just as low as you can. Remember to breathe. Okay, and when you're ready, just slowly go back to the top and switch sides. So whenever you're ready, just stretch down. We are almost there. And it's amazing to see how everyone is doing so great. Okay, whenever you're ready, go back up and you are done for today.